of it, but first, the second carjacking in three days targeting an elderly victim, an 87 year old man in the hospital as police search for the crook who put him there. And he has a coincidental connection to the first victim. Max Darrow joins us live near Rainbow in Charleston where this latest attack happened. This attack happened right here in this complex as a man was trying to just park his car in his garage. Metro offering strong words tonight for the people responsible. Learning about this brutal carjacking attack on a 76 year old man was very disturbing to Al Reisner, but little did he know the next elderly carjacking victim in the valley would be his 87 year old tenant. There's no reason for this person to have done what they did. Uh, it's just. To me, it's unfathomable. Reisner says his tenant called him from the ambulance on the way to Summerlin Hospital Thursday afternoon. The attack left him with a broken collarbone. The victim told Reisner he thinks a young man followed him from his mailbox to his garage door and jumped him. When he opened the garage door, they came in and that's when they, they got his keys and his, uh, stole his car and left him. These victims are some of our most vulnerable citizens. Metro Police Deputy Chief Chris Jones says these two attacks do not appear to be connected. However, he says the recent string of attacks on the elderly is a serious concern to the department. As of Thursday night, two suspects are still on the loose, but he leaves them with this strong message. We will identify you, locate you, and arrest you. Do not think for one moment that you can terrorize the public, especially our most vulnerable citizens. Reisner says he wants this man caught and hopes his tenant will have a speedy recovery. Hope he gets well soon. Hope he comes home soon. And for this latest incident, we do have a suspect and vehicle description tonight. The suspect is described as a black male in his 20s, around five foot nine, and he was last seen wearing a brown pullover and light pants. The vehicle, this is the one that Metro wants you to look for, a 2014 silver Toyota Avalon, plate number 170ZGV. If you have any information regarding this incident or anything with the other carjacking incident, you're urged to give Metro a call or call Crime Stoppers at number 385 55 55. Reporting live tonight, Max Darrow.